Welcome to the NatFL channel, where we keep you updated on NFL news every day. Brian Flores, in fact, said he expected all of his assistants to return next season after he made several changes last offseason. When it comes to quarterback Ryan Fitzpatrick, though, Flores didn't have the answer. We've got to go through a full process, a full evaluation, Flores said Tuesday. We'll evaluate offense, defense, special teams and then we'll create a vision of what we want our team to look like in 2021. You don't do that one day or two days after the season. Dot dot dot, we're not going to rush anything. We're going to take our time with it. Obviously, Fitz, along with all of the free agents, are going to be a part of the conversation because we know them. We're not going to sit here and say, hey, we might want to do this, that or the other. We've got to go through it and be as thorough as possible and try to make the best decisions for this organization. The first step in a possible Fitzpatrick return for a third season with the Dolphins is for him to decide whether he wants to continue playing. His contract expires after this season and he'll become an unrestricted free agent in the spring. Fitzpatrick, who turned 38 in November and has seven children, has said time and time again that what keeps him going is the opportunity to compete and that time has passed in Miami. So from his standpoint, Fitzpatrick would have to be willing to return as a backup from the start of the season, as opposed to 2020 when he began as the starter before the Dolphins made a quarterback switch during their bye in Week 7. If Fitzpatrick still wants to at least have the chance to be a starter, he'd have to look elsewhere, though there probably aren't many teams where he'd have a legitimate chance of accomplishing that goal. From the Dolphins' perspective, having a quality backup like Fitzpatrick would be valuable and his relationship with Tungavailoa is a good one, but Fitzpatrick also came off the bench to replace the 2020 first-round pick twice and the Dolphins might not want to place Tua in a scenario where he might be looking over his shoulder because of precedent.